my friends, I am here to show you my TBR pile for the Christmas Booktubeathon as well as the Cramathon. I've actually already filmed all of this and I went to edit and upload and then something just happened on my computer and like something just like crashed and here we are again doing it. <laughs> but it's okay, I just wanna show you what I had planned basically for tomorrow basically throughout like the next six days. Um, some of you are just participating in the Christmas book two-a-thon and that's just this weekend. Uh, but I am also participating in the cram -a -thon, like I said, which is hosted by Witty Novels. I will link both of the Twitter accounts below. I'm not for sure if the cram -a -thon is gonna have sprints and things, I think maybe, but I know for sure the Christmas book two -a -thon is gonna be hosting sprints because I'm hosting some of the sprints on Saturday. <laughs> so. What I have here is a whole whole mess of books. I'll just start showing you. Uh, first, I have My True Love Gave to Me, and this is by a whole bunch of YA authors. I've been really looking forward to reading this for a while. The cover is beautiful to me. So I'm actually reading this along with Tastic, Jessie the Reader, and the Booktuber, and possibly Cash J. Tuck if she can uh, join us. But at the end of this month, we are going to actually be discussing this uh, on the 28th at 7 p.m. Eastern Time on the Booktuber's channel. So I'll put all that info below. Make sure you're subscribed to him. But I know a lot of you have been tweeting me that you're actually also reading this. So you guys can come join us in the live show and we shall talk about it. Next, I have a couple of graphic novels. I have seen these everywhere and I may not get to both of these throughout these next few days but I want to at least read one and that is In Real Life and Anya's Ghost. So if any of you have read either of these books or if you've read them both whatever tell me what you liked more because I really don't know which one to pick up first and maybe I'll get to both of them. I don't know. And then next I have a whole bunch of comics or graphic novels or whatever these are but it's adventure time and i've already read the first one and i loved it i own it and i just flew through it so i've got uh i saw these at the library and i just had to pick them up but here's the second one here's the third one which is probably my favorite this is the fourth and then the fifth so these ones i'll probably save towards more of like the Cramathon kind of because that readathon is more for reading smaller books. Next, um, on my Kindle, I have the Demon King, which is the first book in the Seven Realms series. It's a fantasy series. I first heard about it from Reagan uh, from Prue's Project, and so I also have the second one on my Kindle. But I got those two plus book three and four from the library. I'm not expecting to read this whole series. I know I'm not crazy. I mean, these are on average like 500 pages a piece. But I just started, I'm currently reading The Demon King and I am really enjoying it so far. I'm only like maybe 20% of the way, but it's really good so far. So I definitely want to at least read some of these books. I may not get to all of them. I know it's a lot. And the last book I had to show you, I may not get to this, but this is just one of the options, and that is Blankets by Craig Thompson. And this is what the Book Explosion group is reading this month. So I saw this, again, I saw this at the library, and I thought, oh, I should pick it up. And it is a graphic novel, and it is the biggest graphic novel I have ever seen in my life. But I definitely, I think that um, this sounds pretty good. It's about, I think, two brothers, and I know it's about, like, uh, teenagers and first love and all the stuff that comes with that. So I know how I am and I know that we're talking about six days here. So I know there's a possibility that I'll start one of these books and not want to read it, which is totally fine. I can move on to another one or I actually have on my Kindle quite a few ebooks that are just kind of random books that I've been wanting to read. So I am going to have my Kindle with me, you know, this weekend and stuff. Uh, I'm actually traveling, so I think I should have a lot of time to read tomorrow and Sunday and on. I just, I don't think I'm going to have much time Saturday because I'm actually going to be visiting family and we're going to go see the new Hobbit movie. Um, I will be doing the Twitter sprints, but yeah, I don't really know how much time I'm going to read like Saturday, but hopefully tomorrow I can a, a lot. So you guys should let me know if you are planning on participating in either of the readathons and maybe what you plan on reading. You don't have to share your whole TBR if you don't want to, but maybe at least like one book that you're really looking forward to. Um, also, I am gonna be doing update videos at the end of the day. It's probably gonna be sort of like this, which is just kind of a one take unedited sort of thing. So that way every single night I can kind of fill you in 
on the day and what I read and all that. I might also accomplish some of the challenges, but since I really do want to read all of those books, um, I'm just going to kind of stick with those and not really change my TBR pile to fit the challenges. I mean, if I complete some of the challenges, then great, but you know, we'll just kind of see how it goes. So that is it. I'm going to go read, but I will see you tomorrow with my next update video for day one, and I will see you then. Bye.